Two Americans share the Nobel Prize in Economics. Indiana University political scientist Eleanor Ostrom is the first woman winner of the prize since it was created in 1968. A great thrill, a very big surprise. Uh, what a way to start a Monday morning. <laughs> She's the fifth woman winner this year, also a record. Ostrom says it was tough being a woman starting a Ph.D. program in 1965. Well, I entered it for love. I didn't enter it to get a job because I was warned I wouldn't get one. UC Berkeley economist Oliver Williamson is the other laureate. His son woke him up at 3.30 in the morning and told him he had an important phone call. I had a, a hint that uh, it might in fact be the good news that uh, uh, knowing that the Nobel Prizes were being awarded today in economics. So I, uh, I answered the phone to find to my uh, great pleasure that that was indeed the case. The two are recognized for their work involving the rules by which people exercise authority in companies and economic systems. The Royal Swedish Academy of Sciences has... Americans dominated the Nobel Prizes this year, taking home 11 out of 13. That includes the surprise announcement Friday that President Barack Obama won the Peace Prize. In awarding the Economics Prize, the Academy did not specifically cite the ongoing financial crisis, but many of the problems at the heart of the financial upheaval involve a perceived lack of regulatory oversight. The awards were clearly a nod to the role of rules, institutions, and regulations in making markets work. Ostrom and Williamson will split $1.4 million. The Economics Prize was the last Nobel award to be announced this year. Matt Friedman, The Associated Press.